Welcome to the world of Tyria, and welcome to the land of the Ashura. My name is Kuja Magister, and you're about to watch a very massive walkthrough. The game that everybody has been talking about for years on end, Guild Wars 2. So sit back, grab a coffee, and enjoy the journey that we take with Castratia. Thank you all for watching, this is my let's play of Guild Wars 2. Welcome to the world of Tyria. And welcome to the land of the Ashura. My name is Kuja Magister, and you're about to watch a very massive walkthrough. The game that everybody has been talking about for years on end, Guild Wars 2. So sit back, grab a coffee, and enjoy the journey that we take with Castratia. Thank you all for watching, this is my let's play of Guild Wars 2. Do a little dance, make a little love, get down to the- oh, oh, hello. Hello, hello, my name is Kuja Magister and welcome back to Guild Wars 2 Castratia Story. I hope you've all had a fantastic Christmas and a brilliant start to the new year. Wow, last episode was quite a while ago. As you can see, everything is a little bit more high def. I got a new setup and it's, it's beautiful now, it's so amazing. Um, so yeah, I think I have no idea what we should do really. I don't think we should do our main story yet. Uh, it's level 4. It is level 4. Let's do it. Okay, so we're going to rent our instance. I'm sure I don't need to go over these these little things for you guys now. Taking credit back. Hello, Paul. How are you? Always be loyal to your crew. Definitely. That's that's a plan and a half right there, my friend. Mr. Sparkles. No, well, Mr. Sparkles, you're supposed hey, to sparkle, not disappear. <laughs> I love some of the characters in this game. Oh, hello, Zoya. to the ambush party. The inquest column should be along at any moment now. I'm eager to pin the inquest ears back. Is this a straight smash and grab, or are there hidden subtleties? Sure. We'll subtly punch their faces, crack their golems, and take what they stole. Mr. Sparkles here was just made for subtlety. Subtle enough for me, and no less than they deserve. Is there any chance we can do this without resorting to violence? Guys? Guys? Oh well, you can't blame me for helping. So, we're going to go ambush the Inquest Caravan, let's go. Uh, so on your map, I'll just go over them quickly again, you'll see your little green markers, that's where you have to head basically. Which is what we're going to do now. Hopefully I can get back into this game, it's been a little while since I've played it to be fair. Last time I played was probably the last episode that I put up. Um, because honestly I just wasn't that impressed with the, uh, with the quality that I was putting up, so I just wa I wanted to make it as good as possible really. And um, I'm going to try and learn the ropes again now and hopefully not get my uh, my backside handed to me. Okay. So normal rules apply on this little encounter. Kill everything. <laughs> Charge your ones and your twos. As I'm going to call them now, I'll pick up pretty much everything as well. I'm sorry if you can hear some button bashing going on. Sometimes that's what this game comes down to really is quick button bashing. Um, but just... There we go, that's, that wasn't too bad. What's this? Interspatial Translocator, we'll pick that up. That seems important. Oh, not underwater combat, really? Ah, sorry, you come to the surface for me, that, that makes life easier. And we are locked, why are we locked? Oh dear, this doesn't look good. Well, 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 what's this? Patent infringement, perhaps? That is, my patent infringing on your freedom. I knew you petty-minded losers would try to steal the interspatial translocator. That's why I set this trap, which you fell for because you're stupid. How did you get to Counselor Flack? Bribes, blackmail, or did you put the fear in him? When we expose this rotten mess, you'll pay for what you've done. Yeah, and in the meantime, we're going to kick your behind so hard, you'll be wearing it as a hat. <laughs> Affirmative. Prepare to don the behind. <laughs> I love some of the, yes, the characters yes, in this game. Very threatening. I'm literally quaking with fear. So badly that I can barely clean up you loose ends by doing this. Okay, time to fight. Subject two. Oh. Time to get you all nice and disassembled. On to subject three. Wait. You're starting to smoke. Okay, so we got um teleported somewhere else. The first time a device malfunction worked in 
our favor. We were probably supposed to end up in a volcano. Okay, so where are we supposed to go then, Paul? Kinda looks like we need to go this way, down to the uh, little green That's circle there. The Ooh, okay. Now, I'm gonna switch on to fire, I think. Simply because it seems more powerful, really. So you've got your uh, typical AoEs when it comes to fire, and um, you're just basic. Fire seems to be, right now, the most powerful. Uh, water seems to be kind of crowd control, and um, thunder seems to be a bit of both, really. So yeah, we're just um, going to keep keep on learning the ropes, because honestly, like I say, this is my first mage. So I really, <laughs> I really don't know what to uh, what to think. Uh, burning retreat, quickly roll back, was leaving behind a line of fire that burns, so that's good for getting away. And then AoE, and then auto target, and then go in for the kills. So yeah, the, our number three move there, the uh, flame burst, does damage in an area, as well as number two. Uh, but number two is static, whereas number three follows the people about, which is kind of good. There we are. Sit down, Mr. Wincrest Technician. You are not wanted here. And as per usual, pick up all of the uh, items that you see. They're good for selling. No, Mr. Not Mr. Sparkles! No, we'll get you sparkling in no time, our friendly, um, robot, <laughs> I guess. Welcome back, Mr. Sparkles. I need to know what happened. Where's Doja? Insufficient data at this time. Working. There. I have located Doja's tracking signal. She is in the Inquest Metrica Province lab. If Doja's there, so is Kao. And I want to give Kao a piece of my mind and all of my fists. Meet me there, Mr. Sparkles, and we'll bust Doja out. Head back to the lab, Paul. You'll be safe there. Do some digging and see if you can find anything that will give us an edge. Finally, a task that doesn't require bruising or being bruised. I'm on it. You go do what you're good at, Paul. <laughs> you seem a bit of a uh, coward. And there we are, mission complete. Let's see, what do we want here? Uh, Majors probably are going to want... I'm going to say probably an axe, I reckon. And then we get a new leather bag, which gives us some more slots. And, lovely, little level up there into level 5. Let's see... Uh, right, I need to have a look here. I haven't got any shoulder pads right now. Sorry if you can hear my steam stuff going on in the background. I should have remembered to uh, log out of that. Uh, dull dagger, we can't... Well, we can use those, but it's not as good as our staff, anyway. Okay. So we're going to exit the instance by pressing this little door down here, and get back into the Metrica province. Okay. So dead. PRNT apprentice. Out about this. Has to help me. Uh, create ooze from engineered plant. Kill wild ooze. And experiment with projected miniature oozes. Okay. Um. So do I do I talk to you? I do help you. Two out of seven. Okay. Where is it? It's over there in our little mini map, as you can see, the orange the orange circle. New event nearby. We love these events. Okay, so we head towards... I'm going to make my map a bit bigger. We need to head towards these little fists here. Ah, and then kill the ooze. Because the ooze is not our friend, apparently. <laughs> We're going to burn him. AoE. AoE, bitches. And there we are. So do I talk to it now? No, I suck it up. <laughs> suck it right up. Okay, and we're going to kill the rest of them. Accelerating. Oh, accelerating. Where are we accelerating? Have I picked some... Oh, okay, I need to go bring her back to him. Oh, God. Oh, God, what have I done? <laughs> okay, I didn't read the mission brief very well, though, I don't think. Probably should have read it a bit better. No big deal. We should be able to kill them still. I hope. That's it. They're dead. No big deal, of course. Not a problem for us. Suck it right up. Ah, there we are. So we need to go and take it back to our friend down here. Or at least I think we do. Return the toxic users to the storage tanks. Oh, okay. We need to go back to the storage tanks. There must be a few of those kicking about somewhere. Come on, Mr. Ooze. You ain't got nothing on us. Oh, I'm sorry, Boar. No, Boar. I didn't want to kill you. Oh, God. I'm sorry. It's just AoE. I'm sorry. I'm gonna try that number four, see what that does. 
Oh, okay, so if he follows us now, that hurts him. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And the ooze seems to uh, come back after a short while as well. Not helpful. Not helpful at all. Right, come with me. You are mine. And where are these tanks? Where are the tanks? Where do... Ah, there they are. They're... No, they're yellow flowers. Well, I don't get it, honestly. Just don't get it. No big deal, we'll keep helping the uh, PR and T though. Because that gives us stuff. Okay, and we're going to revive these guys here. Because that will give us some more in our heart meter as well, which is always good. And revive this guy. I don't know what those ozone alternators do though. Oh, oh! I'm in damage. When you're in, when you're um, in combat, sorry, when you're in combat, it um, stops you from being able to revive really quick. So basically, that guy is just tanking them for us while we revive him, and that'll give us some more stuff, some more XP, which is always good. And then I'll help them out because I'm a good guy like that. I'm a good guy. Okay, we've almost finished helping them now. Ooh, this looks pretty cool. It gives us quite a lot of um, quite a lot of stuff. This tower is planted here. Turn sludge when zapped with the ozone alternator. What? What? Okay. Yeah, I'm not too sure what this um, return the toxic uses to the storage tanks is. I can't seem to find them, so... We're going to drop this weapon because it's really bad. It's so bad, it should feel bad. So, number three, and then just finish them off. Only got a few more to do now, and then we have a... Then we've leveled up, so that's all good news. They're probably in there, the, the used tanks. Don't really see a point in doing it, to be fair. It's not going to give us that much extra H uh, XP, so... Kind of unnecessary. But, with this guy revived, we should only have to do a couple more bits. Ah, there they are, they're there, look. Yeah, it's really, really not that much point. It takes so long to get them back there, it just takes forever. So we're just going to revive this guy here. Oh, and kill this ooze first, actually. So yeah, I hope you guys had a uh, really good Christmas. Um, I did. I love Christmas. It's so much fun. Just being around your family. I have quite a lot of family that um, live in Scotland. Um, obviously quite north on the British Isles. Um, so yeah, I get, they come down most of the time and it's, it's always good. It's always great fun. So what are your New Year's resolutions? I honestly don't have any. Um, but if you have any, put them down in the comments because I am interested in knowing what they are. And there's a present for us. Oh, present. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> okay, well, um, that wasn't the nicest present I've ever had. And now I'm being all sorts. I've been all sorts as well. Okay, well, this definitely wasn't a nice present. Um, help! Help! Run away, press 6 to give yourself some... Oh, or not, we're dead. Definite dead. Ah, oh, That wasn't very nice. See if we can kill this toy golem before they kill us. We might be able to do it. Nope, probably not actually. Nope, we have died. Well, isn't that just cheerful? <laughs> Got killed. Well, we were quite a way away as well. Okay, we're going to go back to just our falls. Okay, let's see then. Uh, destroy the beacons powering the inquest lab. They are underwater, and that to me is a bad idea. <laughs> but we can do this one actually. Uh, drive off lab inquest. Drive off the inquest invading the Opticalium lab. We'll go and do that. I think that seems like a much better plan. Don't know if there's other people doing it. Normally is. Yeah, there is. There's a few. Well, there's a few NPCs doing it at least, which is a good sign. You know how these work by now, guys. All you do, target and kill. Kill them. Uh, we're going to switch to water. See what that does. We haven't unlocked hardly any water yet, which is a bit weird. Would have thought we would have by now. Where are the rest of you? Come on. There we are. 
see, we've only got a number one on water so far, which is Water Blast, spray a jet, spray a jet of water that also heals allies in a blast radius. Oh, so water is the support class, basically, yeah, um, which is pretty cool. Oh, uh, no, we haven't met. Why, what's your name? Zeb, okay. Good to meet you, Zeb. Where are you? Oh, and we have a email, well, just a normal mail, we get some money. My crew has proven to be quite incompetent at times, but you've never shown any signs of such stupidity. That's great, that's just a, a kick in the face, really. <laughs> How intelligent exactly are we, is my question. And there we are, they are doomed. Oh. Where's this other guy, come on, he's obviously hitting us somewhere. Sparks, really, sparks? Oh, we have our level 2 spell now, which is Ice Spike, a giant Ice Spike, wow. That is, um, yeah, that's pretty giant, alright, I'll give it that. We will probably level up from this, to be fair, we're, we're doing quite a lot, quite a lot of work. It normally gives you more XP the more work you do, so. Come on, where are the rest of you? I may uh, speed the rest of this up, so forgive me if that's what happens. <laughs> Seems like it's going to be quite a long mission, so. one is finished we're going to chase this ball off we're trying to destroy this area and there we go we got a gold rank 311 xp and 32 karma points don't know whether i've uh, talked about karma points at all i shall now karma points are basically what buys you high-end pve gear it's just some of the best gear you can get in the game we won't have enough really to buy anything cool yet um but later on later on you'll see what i mean where we get some of the really cool stuff and um, I think for our first reboot back into this lovely little series, I think that will do for now. So I hope you guys have had a fantastic Christmas and a brilliant new year, or at least a brilliant new start to it. I hope it carries on. And I will see you on the next one.